What do we got going? We got Chulbin in here. Let Chulbin play. 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 We got Seaverk as well. Death Seal, who's going up first, apparently. Crexi playing some elemental. And we got PV God Damn. We're gonna play last time. Was it worse than I guess actually? It's gonna be Aaron. Fury Warrior Extraordinaire. We got ourselves Binus hanging out in the back. Been a while since we've seen this ugly son of a bitch. Cinderella chill in the back. Lol, lol, and Sargeras. We got ourselves Death Seal versus Aaron. And Aaron trying to go for some damage. Death Seal is going to pop that IBF a little bit early, actually. Try to see if he can get a massive necrotics. Maybe no. Getting the Army of the Dead rolling. Both of these two looking like they're lagging a little bit, actually. Or Aaron looking like he's lagging a little bit. It's going to get a reflect up and running a little early. Not really sure what he can reflect against Air, uh, against Death Seal. And Death Seal is going to go for that transfusion. Aaron is going to get himself that charge heal. Death Seal is choosing to trink it out of that fear. Does Aaron roll a double charge? No, he rolls a stun. Abomination does join the fight. And Aaron doesn't want to deal with it. But that's going to be stunned down on him. He's going to be clapped down by all the pets. That's when Necrotics has started to stack up. Join damage back to air, back to Death Steel. Is going to get the Reflect going to Reflect. Couple of casts at the Mages of the Dead. But that's still a lot of pressure on him right now. Lots of Necrotics. Safety Trick and even proc it. Death Steel actually at low health. Going to be massing this for air right now. Needs to get a charge heal. Does land him. Malik to follow on that though. Still continues to heal as much as possible. More Necrotics is stacked up. Death Steel getting slammed down with a stun. Does have a Malik for him, but he had an AMS a little bit early. Aaron should have saved that AMS for a little bit, but still does get the land. Then execute off of Death Steel, and down goes Vin Rookie. Where Chill Blaine is going to go in and clean up the mess real quick with Aaron. It's like, shush, 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 shush. Let me just, just, just sleep. 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 Chill Bane. Trying to see if he can land a stun onto Aaron now with that. Morseless Winter doesn't get enough stacks in there though. Trying to see if he can get Chillbane out. Does land a hit on him. Chillbane versus Lolo right now. As Lolo is not wasting any time getting in there, landing us on Chillbane. And we are seeing an IBF, not Lichborn. Or is it Lichborn? I think it is an actual IBF this time. Or maybe it was Lichborn. I'm not even sure. It do Lichborn doesn't show up for Frost Death Nets for whatever reason. But maybe Chillbane did a Lichborn. Maybe IBF. We guess we'll have to wait and see if he uses that at about a. 30 seconds or so. Chillbane is going to get some cooldowns rolling while he's got low lol in here. Look, Shout is coming out for the rogue. Not going to get evasion rolling as Chillbane is getting a lot of the physical damage in there. Going to be instant triggered off the strangle. It does land a kidney shot onto Chillbane, but more defensive kidney. Chillbane chooses to trick it out of that stunt, out of the blind, I guess. Did it Lichborn out of that? I don't even know how he got out of that stun. Was that heavily DR maybe? He triggered the blind for sure. I think. Maybe triggered that, they got blinded, and then lol broke his own blind. Could I be wrong? Am I dumb? Maybe. Good possibility. We'll never know. Sap coming in. Chillbane is going to have to sit the CC for quite a bit of time. That's going to be low. Just trying to recover a little bit of health while in style. Doing a fairly good job recovering them. Chillbane option now to grab himself the eye. Doesn't snag it! Does he realize he didn't snag it? He thinks he has the eye, I think. He's looking for him. He's like, checking every corner, but the eye is still there. He's like, ah, oh, shit. <laughs> I never grabbed it. <laughs> uh, I wonder how he feels, dude. I wonder what he said IRL. Like, shit. Like, god damn it. Get a shot coming down on Chul Bane. No way out of it. Looks like he does roll IBF. No Lichborn. Others would have seen him getting out of CC a little bit more often. AMS coming up a little bit early. As Lol is going to go for that evasion. Sun coming up for Chul Bane is going to get some damage into Lol, but he's going to get the heal rolling. Frost DK is more sustained based damage. So against Lol, Lol popping a concoction actually does a lot, especially when Chul Bane is not bursting on him. But Chul Bane is starting to ramp up. He is getting some damage. Maybe he'll get a stun to Lol Lol with Remorseless Winter. Does he even roll the talent for it? Hard to tell. But he's going to try to land a slow into Lowell. He's trying to stay on him as best as he can. Continue to hit obliterate at him. Continue to hit him with everything. Malarek onto the rogue. Lowell won't be able to reheal for this for a while. 
He does have a long lasting frost fever though, so he's not even gonna land a resell that easily, and it's gonna deny him that opener as a rogue. Chillbane is gonna get more immersive winter popping and more cooldowns right now, getting his own room powered runic weapon going with chance fusion to follow. Lol does slam him down with a DFA, but all that plate armor really keeps Chillbane afloat, trying to get himself a small heal maybe. That's gonna be stunned. Lol doesn't look like he's healthy, it looks like the common cold literally took him down. For the count and up next is going to be Binance, Chilbane slowing down progression for Binance, slowing down the advances. Is going to get that Pillar of Frost rolling right now. Binance does have a Reflect available, not really sure he's going to reflect anything out of Chilbane. Does land a stun on him to follow them. And Chilbane has to deal with all the damage that Binance is going to be putting out. IBF coming down a little bit early as a defensive. Maybe he has like an honor talent with IBF or something. Or not an honor talent. Maybe it is an honor talent. Well, can... No. Wait, does he? Hard to tell, AMS coming down for, for Chillbane a little bit early. Binance is still hanging in and not playing the double charge build. Not going for the massive heals. That's actually taking quite a bit of damage from Chillbane over time. Try to see if he can bail out of there. Not try to get a charge in there, but I think charge did go through. He does get stunned. Does shake it out of him immediately. That is going to be a reflect for Binance right now. In case Chillbane got anything for him. Not that I've got anything for him. He's going to continue pressuring him steadily. Binance needs to wait for another charge heal if he can nab one. Not going to be able to snag one. He's going to get a bloodthirst in it. 5% dampening rolling right now and Chilbane does check it out of that stun and that's gonna be Binance actually dropping fairly low on health after all those duels where he was obliterating people is gonna have to go for that enraged regen does let a charge heal with enraged regen does let that heal Chilbane is gonna have to go for transfusion himself just to recover from this 6% dampening rolling out right now and Binance is again wants to get a charge in as many charges as he can reflect coming in for Chilbane not really sure what can reflect from Chilbane on damage wise but he's gonna try to pop it should probably wait for the Maledict and Chilbane is going to set him running with a Frost Fever though. Binance does have a doubt on him. It is rolling. The auto attacks are stacking up. The damage of Obliterates and Frost Strikes from Chilbane are stacking up as well. Even a little bit of Death Strikes. So that's going to be Malatica to Binance right now. No way to bail out of this. He's going to Kai Chilbane while he's got him. Is there anything you can do? Can he come back somehow? Stun coming down. Chilbane is going to get his own abilities and power right now. Is going to get the uh, Runic Weapon. Hunger rolling. He's going to get the Pillar of Frost rolling. This way he's got all the damage in the world. Going to ramp up into Binus. He needs to keep him slow the whole time. Gripping him back in. Again, needs to keep him slow the whole time. And Binus doesn't have any way out. And Chilbane does obliterate him. Two more dudes left. Next up is going to be Cinderella. Can Chilbane do anything against Sin? This is going to be the Bleeds and Roots and Kites all day. Chilbane, not looking that good on defenses right now. No IBF, no AMS, no Trinket for quite a bit. Only has Death back. And he might need everything to beat Cinderella here. That's going to be Thorns early. Does try to get a root onto Cinderella. He's going to go for that uh, Dark... Dark... Dark Sacrifice? Is that what it is? I actually drew a blank. I don't remember what that ability name is. Don't hate me, shot. I actually drew a blank. But he did wait out for Dark... Not Transfusion. Is it Dark Sacrifice? I feel like it. Why am I doubting myself? Bash coming in onto Chilbane. Can he recover from this? Can he get his fusion rolling? Another bite, but the plate armor keeping him afloat. This way he can finally start doing some damage. Popping in the racial in there. Try to see what he can do while IBF is running on him. Cinderella is starting to take some damage, but before it really ramps up, he's going to bail out. Death pack. That's exactly what it is, Zachary. That's exactly what it is. Does get a stun onto Chilbane. Gonna get the AMS rolling a little bit early in case Cinderella does get Thorns up and running. Maybe a little too early. So where? This is now Cinderella can punish him with Thorns. Stun coming onto Sin. This way Chilbane again trying to get the resources. Needs to get the big transfusion heal rolling ASAP. Big bite coming in by Cinderella. Chilbane does get the Death Strikes while he has it. But that's where he's gonna go down. The Frost DK goes. That's gonna be Crackside. He's gonna get that stun DR lasso in there. Haymaker to knock him out is gonna get the Primal Storm Elemental going. He's continuing to get slows on the Cinderella. Back to back slows. And it's gonna healing surge coming out right now. Can he do anything about it? Antonio Branch, how you doing, my man? Hope I said it right. Bastard to crack side. Bike coming in for sin. Does have a trinket. He's gonna trinket that lasso immediately. Renewal coming out very soon. Crack side has a wall. Might want to use it early. Might want to pre wall this damage right now. Trying to get a healing surge. Is that going to be called bad by Sin? I think it was. Stone coming out. Stone keeper to follow. Not going to happen. And Seavark needs to land the killing blow onto Sin. Sin is dotted up. He needs to land the killing blow right now. Shadow Strike coming out. Gets an Ablin in there. Hey, Merrick to follow. Knocks him. Is that going to be tricky? Probably not. Seavark needs to sprint back in there, man. 
Trying to aim with Cinderella. Cinderella's actually not going to get AoE. Get a shot coming down. Let's see what we're going to do for the big damage. Oh, we're going to see a Titan Pharaoh fall down. Back to back cheap shot. Eviscerates will follow. Another Eviscerate getting Cinderella critically low. Cloak or Shadow is coming out for Seaver. Tricky side of the stun. But it's going to get slowed down regardless, though. No matter what happens. Still slowed completely. Shadow Blades are rolling. Once you get the big damage in there, Cinderella's going to run by, get dots on him, and run the hell out of there. Needs to nail down Cinderella. Maybe should have blinded him while low. Maybe should have blinded him. Cinderella's still hanging in, though. Still not out of the fight. Seawark no longer with the trinket. Cinderella's going to get that opener, get the blades up and running. Maybe even root to follow. Seawark does get evasion rolling. That's going to be a heal for Cinderella. Uses that regrowth. Cashes in right now. Bear for him to try to hang on. Kidney shot coming down. Nothing out of it. Seawark, this is your chance right now. If you land an eviscerate, big damage to Cinderella. Does go down. Almost didn't have it. Blind onto Sargeras. He's not going to trinket this. Not going to trinket this. Last man standing on Team Blue. I like your mark, by the way. I like the brighter colors of Death Knight. I like that helmet and the pieces of gear got working for it, by the way. I'm digging that, dude. Can we just say, this guy has one of the coolest mugs I've ever seen. Very blue. Very bright blue, too. I like it a lot. Does pick up the eye. The pet does stop him with a stun. Shortest stun in the world. IBF coming out for Saragars. And it's going to get the army rolling. Seavark doesn't have cloak. Doesn't have nothing. Try to see if he can end this right now. But that A-bomb is not going to let him go anywhere. It does try to get a shadow step in there. It's going to Maledic or the Sargeras. It's going to go for that stun. Going to be short of stun. And Seavark actually getting a blitter run damage. Cloak and shot is coming out. And down he goes. PvE God X is the last guy standing. Is he AFK? No, he's not. He's actually not AFK. Sagar is the bop is a bomb. He packed a lot of his defenses, so PV got X. I feel like it's a massive advantage of this duel. 58% dampening. We'll see how it goes down. Good luck at the fun, boys. This is a good old set of duel. PV got whenever you're ready, man. Saragar Saragars. Saragars. I keep saying it wrong. Every time. It's gonna get a chain of ice in it. PV got getting the resources rolling a little bit early. Saragars might have to go death packed a little bit early right now. I didn't remember that this time, boys. It's gonna trick a death pack dead right now. Big damage coming out by PvE God. Nothing Saragars could do. Does get the AMS, but the damage of a paladin is just way too high. Good set of duels there, boys. Let's get another one going. Hell yeah. Zachary already got a group, so somebody gotta get a group up. Zachary, let me know if you still got a group.